Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for. Oh, it, isn't it like the? Is it like the full moon? Yeah, right around the full moon, April seventh. So you know the timing is fluid, but you know. It is what it is. Just take it for what it, what it is, when it is, whatever. Timing is fluid. We're just going to see what comes up for a message today. For around the April full moon. What do we have for a message today? Working together to build happiness. To build a home. To build a life together. I feel like there's this is communication, putting in effort to bring happiness. So this is definitely working together, putting in effort. Um, teamwork. There's teamwork at home. There's there's people that these people are working together to build a happy home. Making compromises. Probably working in the yard. Getting ready for spring. Getting ready for Easter. Something like that. Um, there's This is like communication though. This is communication. Compromising. Extending an offer. Extending help. So. And this is about uh, working together to be a family. You know, putting in effort. So, so we have definitely putting in effort, working together. This is like unification of some sort. A happy home. To build a happy home. Spending money together, whatever. Building. This is a builder. Building up your home. Working on the home. See the the hammer, you know, it may cost some money. It, fixing the home, working on the home, building up the home, making the home more comfortable. So that's that's a big focus right here. I'll zoom that in just a minute. Two of Wands reversed. Now the Two of Wands reversed is uh, restriction. There's some sort of restriction unsure deciding not to canceling something canceled plans because of the delay because of the canceled plans i got it i got it okay so because there's there's no movement working at home which makes sense right can't go anywhere stuck you're stuck you, you're at the crossroads you can't go anywhere you're stuck you might as well work on your home so this is like working on your home not going anywhere um there's canceled plans, right? A lot, all these plans have been canceled. We might as well work work together on the home, uh, build it up. This, there's some level of disappointment here that we can't go anywhere. They, obviously, everybody is disappointed out, about that. Um, five of Cups reversed. Let me get another card. Moving on. Letting bygones be bygones. Focusing on the future. Now, I wonder if there's going to be a reunion here. Somebody may be, uh, you know, yeah, letting bygones be bygones. They may have been indecisive, you know, wondering what they want to do. Now they want to fix something. They want to fix up a, a union. They want to, because this is fixing something. Fixing something up. Hmm. Let's fix it. Let's fix it. Let's fix it together. Ooh, there's been a lack of judgment, though. There's been a level of unawareness. Moving on from that bad choice. Both of these cars. So somebody is moving on from a bad choice. They've been stalled. Now they're offering something. Hmm. I wonder if there's like a reunion here or something. You know, a, re or, or, you know, a reunification. This is feeling guilty, feeling ashamed as well, not listening. Lack of judgment. Somebody made a poor judgment call. Held on to the past or held on to something. Unable to forgive, holding a grudge even perhaps. Wow. 
Five of Pentacles reversed. That is uh, improvements. There is making improvements. Somebody is wanting to make improvements within the relationship. There's been an unhealthy relationship. Somebody was unaware. They were, uh, I don't know, trying to prove something or something like that. But I think we have a turning point here. We have a turning point. Multiple options. There was a level of confusion. Unsure. Definitely unsure. Somebody was unsure of what they wanted to do, whether they wanted to stay or whether they wanted to go, whether they wanted to work on a relationship or whether they wanted to move forward, whether they wanted to uh, make something work or let it go. So that was the the indecisiveness right here. They have multiple options and they were definitely unclear as to what way, what route to go. But I feel like instead of... Uh, Moving on, it's best to fix this. I want to fix this. Can we fix this? Uh, fix something. Fixing something. Maybe fixing something at home. Now, this is a card of karma, and this is a card of karma. So interesting. But this is justice bringing balance, doing whatever it takes, being honest, doing the right thing, um, making a decision, a final decision. Somebody is making a final decision based on the truth, based on the facts. There's been a level of confusion, but now they've gotten the truth because justice is about the truth. It's about the truth coming out or the truth being delivered. Somebody may have been placing all the blame, but now they're ready to take the ownership, you know, and let bygones be bygones and uh, work on this. Let's work on this. Somebody may be receiving communication from somebody that they have... Um, some sort of deep connection with, with the four of wands. They may be receiving communication with somebody that they want to put in. This person decides that they want to put an effort. They want to work on this. There may even be an apology. This person was holding a grudge. Um, they were unclear of what they wanted to do, but now there's some sort of turning point. You know, they see that there's still an opportunity for love. So they make some sort of gesture, um, they make a decision. It's like all of a sudden they see, whereas they weren't aware because this is lack of awareness. Now they see the truth or they see something clearly. There was a level of confusion though, but now they've made some sort of choice because these are both about, we have a lot of decision here. Somebody was indecisive. Now they're, now they know, now they know what they need to do. That's what it looks like to me. I feel like, um, They don't want to fight. I don't want to fight. I don't want to fight. Um, I don't want to play games. It feels like there's there's some sort of uh, cooperating. Let's that's, that's, that's work together. I want to work with you. Something like that. Can we work together? Can we fix this? That's what I keep hearing. Can we fix this? Can, let's fix this. Let's fix this. I think there's been, this is the end of a conflict, okay? There's been some sort of conflict. There's been some sort of major power struggle between two people. Now, I, I just got to point out to you, five, 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 five. Fives are power struggles. Five, five, five is power struggles. It's life choices, conflicts, instability. So, and it's, fives are about choices and a change, Okay, so somebody has been resisting change. They've been unable to make a choice. They've been in a state of confusion. They've been maybe living in fantasy land or in some sort of illusionary situation. Just wasn't seeing a situation clearly. But it's like all of a sudden, and I feel like it is all of a sudden with the two of wands reversed. All of a sudden, they get some sort of epiphany that they weren't aware of in the past. It's like, you know, I really want to work with this person. I want to, I want to um, communicate. I, I feel a connection. I feel a deep connection. So I feel like... There's a turning point where somebody decides, you know, they decide to bring balance because they they don't want to play games. They've been fighting with themselves pretty much. They've been fighting with their own fears. Fears of commitment, probably. But there's definitely an opportunity for happiness here. And for like some sort of reunification or reunion, 
okay? Because this is a reunion. And this is like a reunion. The Five of Cups reverse is going back or a reunion. It's like there's been some sort of loss. It was sad. There was a separation. There was a breakup with the Five of Cups. But it's like now there's a turning point where somebody was ghosted. They were abandoned or they were, you know, whatever, left behind because of uh, pride or shame. Somebody was... Uh, unaware of their feelings or unaware of what they wanted or who knows they were confused now it's like now they see now they see and they want to bring balance they want to do the right thing for for them i think and they're going to extend an offer so i think they are going to extend an offer they've been juggling going back and forth back and forth what do i want to do do i want to do this or not i kind of want to be with this person but i don't i do but i, I don't want to give up my pride i want to have to you know somebody might have to swallow their pride I just feel like that's something that I want to say. Um, I think there's been a lot of competition here. There's a lot of there's been a, some power struggles between these p two people competing at to see who's the boss, who's on top. And I feel like this person finally decides I don't want to play games anymore. I just want to work together. I want to be in this union. I want to be in this. This connection is too strong. I think it's a very strong connection. So I feel like uh, somebody is going to. Um, communicate they're going to communicate that you know how they feel they want they're going to communicate their true feelings they're going to communicate um perhaps they're going to say why why they did something um five 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 there's somebody is making a choice they're making a choice that they were unsure about in the past Definitely wasn't seeing a situation clearly. I feel like we have somebody here that was fearful. They were fearful. And they weren't communicating. They were holding back communication. Really unclear very unclear of what they wanted. Ten of Swords reversed. Now this is something coming back from the dead. You know, this is something coming back. If somebody was abandoned, they were ghosted, they were left behind, they were um, left out in the cold, right? And there's there's been some sort of separation. But now it's like wanting to fix it. Somebody wants to fix it. It's like the worst has happened. And now there's like a recovery. It's it, This is a recovery. It's time to... Can we... There, it, it is capable. There is... Cap, this is capable of being recovered. It is. If somebody can express their feelings, but they haven't been expressing, they've been cold and withdrawn. So I feel like we have this person that um, is feeling maybe even dead inside, feeling lost inside, feeling like there's no chance, feel, yeah, feeling like, like, like there's no chance for, for reconciliation, feeling like they'll be rejected, feeling like, uh, you know, this whole relationship is beyond help, but there's still an opportunity. It's like, that's how they felt. And that's why they didn't communicate. But I feel like they're going to communicate. I feel like some sort, I do feel like communication is coming. We have uh, somebody here that was very confused and they were confused because they were protecting themselves. There's this guy was protecting himself. There could be, I mean, also, we, there's some sort of legal, legal legalities here with the justice card. There could be some, some legal issues here. Fight, uh, fighting the justice system. Fighting karma. This guy can be mentally abusive. I'm just being honest with you. The King of Swords in reverse is somebody that is mentally abusive, verbally abusive. He may say things without thinking. Somebody may have said something without thinking. And now they have, and this could be a major bed. Now you got a lie in it. 
you know, somebody, somebody may have said something without thinking and now they're in trouble. I'm just saying. And I, this could be, this is probably within a relationship. This guy says something because he's pissed off. He doesn't know what he's saying. He's, he's whatever. And, um, now there's some consequences because justice is a card of consequences. But there could be an apology that is coming. This guy may have said something stupid because he wasn't thinking. And now he wants to come back and fix it. He apologizes. So there could be an apology that is coming. It could be. It could be an apology. It absolutely could be. Um... It's not over. That's what I want to say. It's not over yet. It's just not over yet. With that Ten of Swords reverse, this isn't over yet. This guy may be upset. He may be upset that, that, that uh, for what he said. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe that's what it is. Um, no communication. He was blocked. Maybe upset for being blocked. Maybe feeling guilty. Somebody's feeling guilty. This is feeling feeling guilty, feeling guilty. They're feeling guilty. They're feeling guilty for what they said. There may be some jealousy issues here. And this is blocked. Blocked and left behind. Somebody was blocked. They were ghosted. Somebody's feeling guilty for doing that. So I feel like they're going to... They're going to communicate. Whoever this person is, they're going to communicate. And I feel like it's an apology. I do. I feel like... I, I, I don't... I'm, I know there's that narcissist don't apologize. So if you're dealing with a narcissist, then forget it. But um, there, I feel like somebody's going to get an apology. And this is, this is uh, a real. Okay? It's real. It's a real apology with the Three of Pentacles. That's real. Okay? That's a opportunity to fix something. Can we fix this? Can we start over? Let's work together. Um, will you forgive me? That's what I hear. Um, or can uh, we, we fix this? I just want to hear, can we fix this? Seven of Swords. Somebody has to come back. They didn't, they aren't, see, there's, there's something left they need to come back for. There's been some sort of, you now he's, he's got the five of swords in his hand. There's two swords left. There's been a power struggle. These two people were struggling with, with who was in control, who was, who was the most powerful. And I feel like this person may have pushed the other one away or got, think that they, you know, got away with treating a person in a certain manner, but now they feel guilty for treating them like that and they want to go back. So I think we have something that's not over yet and somebody is, 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 it's a, it's a situation. It's definitely not over the death card reversed. Somebody is coming back to, it feels like rectify a situation. Can we try again? Something like that. Um, or for a second chance, but I think they're fearful. I think we had, this person is fearful. Um, they're fearful of rejection. They're fearful of letting their guard down. They may be fearful of commitment, but they may not be ready for a marriage or something like that. There's, there's definitely fear. I think it's fear of commitment, um, fear of marriage, maybe. Um, somebody has, it feels like they've been lying to themselves, trying to prove a point trying to prove their strength, trying to prove their, uh, ability to win. I can't, you know, that, whatever that's called, you know, they wanted to prove their strength. That's what it is, their strength. And I think that it got them in trouble because when you're in a partnership, it's about teamwork. It's not about who's the strongest. It's not about the constant competition. So anyway, I feel like we have somebody here that you know, slipped away. They slipped away and they thought that this was the right thing, but now they're having second thoughts and they want to go back. And I think that it is probably the right thing to do. I think it is, is the right thing to do. This person knows that it's the right thing to do. It's what they want to do. They want to go back. So I think that the, we have somebody here that is going, they want to go back to the way it was. They want to start over. So I feel like this, there's a, a situation that nearly ended but it's not going to end. I think it's it's going to start back up.
So yeah, that's what I got. Good luck.